Thank you, God, for letting me breathe and live another day. Thank you for giving me another chance to be better than I was yesterday. I think we all should start our morning off with prayer and end it off with gratitude. This will do two things for you. Help you control the spirit of your day and unblock any more blessings that are supposed to come your way. Just think about it for a second. How can you ask and expect more when you don't even appreciate what you already have? If you don't appreciate what you already have, do you think you deserve more? I think that's God's way of telling you no. Putting a hold on any more blessings until you appreciate what you have. So take inventory of all that you should be grateful for and where you're at in your life right now. This way of thinking will turn you into a more positive person. It prepares you, gives you a shield of protection from the many negative things in the world around us. Stand guard of your mind. That's all we have to get through anything in life. Do you know who you are? Do you know where you're going? Do you know what you want out of life? Work on strengthening those areas until you become aware. This will make life so fulfilling. Once you are aware, you will begin to create your own happiness and how the story of your life should go. Becoming the best version of yourself and doing only what makes you happy. You will be careful. You will understand. You can't be around certain people or be in certain environments. If it's not uplifting or giving you good energy, you will do what's best for you to stay away. It is so hurtful to your spirit to be around someone that's not on the same page as you. They don't know who they are. They don't challenge you. And that person may be broken with baggage that they won't let go of. Stop trying to help people that won't help themselves. Stop trying to fix people that are broken. It's okay to help others. I think it's a big part of life that's needed. But don't be taken advantage of from someone that doesn't appreciate you. Look for signs of progress. Them showing effort, being willing to try to change. Time is valuable, so move on when things don't seem right. When you know exactly what you want, you disconnect from anybody and anything that's not in line for the same thing. It's not good to be the smartest person in the room. Growth comes from being challenged. Many people want to change. Most will talk, some will do. Don't chase people that God is trying to keep away from you. They are not meant to be in your life. Think of something you might be allergic to, maybe a certain type of food. As you're trying to grow into the best version of yourself, you will have an allergic reaction on your spirit from anyone that doesn't know who they are, that is lazy and negative. Life is short, life is precious. Don't take your time, don't waste your time. Your time might be over by tomorrow, so live your best life today. Hope to catch you next time. Stay motivated.